hey, you want to see some gold, some silver, some coins, some jewelry, some Civil War artifacts, some old, old relics, check this out. I'm going to show it to you right here, right now. Watch this. Hey, good morning, everybody. I'm DK with Adventures in Dirt. Welcome to another episode of The Weekly Dirt. Glad to see you. The Weekly Dirt is a weekly series I put on every Sunday where I'm going to show you the best of what our metal detecting world has to offer us this week. So consider hitting that subscribe button. We'd love to have you as part of the family and come along for the ride. Here we go. Hey, you know it's a great day when you dig your oldest coin ever only to be followed by the next oldest coin ever. Yeah, it was one of those weeks for Tony over at 5280 Adventures as he went back to Ohio and collaborated with Don with Detection Connection. Don put him on a great field and he pulled up some great finds. Check this out from 5280 Adventures. Hey guys, welcome back to 5280 Adventures. I'm out here in beautiful Ohio this week and I'm doing some digging with Detection Connection. All right, guys. Dom promised me I'd get on so, uh, uh, an old coin here. Let's jump in, come on. Oh, there it is. I finally got it. Oh yeah, there's one cent in the back. There's the one cent. Oh yeah. Get the end Date, the 50. 57, 51. Awesome. Congrats, man. Woohoo! All right. Hold it up, 1851. <laughs> <laughs> All right, hopefully, I'm not jinxing myself here, but I've got an 80. 86 all day long. Yep. Oh, oh, silver. 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 Oh, silver. Oh, oh, oh. That's a, that's a, is that a half or a quarter? I think it's quarter. Right. Real. It looks like a real. I think it's a real. It's a real. Yep, Spanish, baby. No way. Spanish silver. Oh. There he is. All right, the there dates at the bottom. Yep, it's right down there. 17. 79. Damn. Awesome. No. Awesome. <laughs> oh, man. Holy cow. 1779. My Spanish Real. Wow. Tony, how awesome is that? My gosh. First, you dig your oldest large scent ever, just the oldest coin you ever dug, and you just were on cloud nine. What a great, great experience. And then you pull the two real. Holy cow, you're into the 1700s. Wow, congratulations, my friend. Awesome, awesome job. Hey, and a special shout out to Detection Connection for putting Tony on some great property. Way to go, Don. What a generous, generous thing you did. Great job, buddy. Everybody, if you're not a fan of 5280 Adventures, head on over to his channel. I'll put the link down below. You gotta check out this whole video. It was just an epic time hunting with Don with the Detection Connection. And if you're not a fan of the Detection Connection, I'm gonna put his link down below too, because you gotta go check him out and give him a big thumbs up for collaborating with other YouTubers and putting them on some good spots. Awesome. Great job, Tony. Great job, Don. Hey, who likes a coin spill? Boy, I love a coin spill. Coin spills are fun. This week, Digger Don, yeah, over in England, hit a great coin spill. Check this out this week from Digger Don. Watch this. I'm just sitting here. I got time. It's clear to see. Anyone hey, back in England? Hey! I'm in a new field today. Another nice signal there. Right, it's out in here, whatever it is. Come on, be Georgie boy. Got to see a nice bit of George. Come on, George. Come out. 
Oh, I think. <gasps> no way. No. <laughs> it is. Oh, please be Josh the Chili. Please be Josh the Chili. Please be Josh the Chili. Vicky Schilling! It's a Vicky Schilling, Kev! I can't believe it, it's fantastic! I've not had a shilling for ages! Oh, fantastic! Oh, nice one. <laughs> oh, nice one. <laughs> <laughs> it's on. Look! There's something else in there, Kev! Oh there's something God. else in there! It's still in there, isn't it? Oh! My oh. God. <laughs> It's a, who's that? It's jo oh, it's a George of Fifth Shilling. Oh, there might be more in there. Oh, that's fantastic. Oh, look, look, two shillings. Check it. Oh. 99. 92. Right, what's in the clod? What's in the clod? Right, it's in here, whatever it is. <laughs> He's massive! He's massive! It's George the Fifth. It's George the Fifth something. <laughs> and it is a George the Fifth. I think it's a florin. I've never had a George the Fifth florin. Oh, mega! Oh, mega, mega, mega! Don, hey, welcome back to England and what a welcome back you got. What an incredible coin spill. Great job. Awesome, awesome coins. Florin, great Florin. Love that Florin. Everyone head on over there and check out all the other stuff she was able to pull up from this field. She was on a new permission for her. Just a great, great hunt. Congratulations, Don. Everyone, links down below. Go check her out. Tell her you saw her here on the Weekly Dirt. That's awesome. Way to go, Don. Hey, how many of your fans out there are Tag Team Recoveries? Boy, great channel. They were on an epic hunt this week. You talk about relics. Boy, I couldn't fit all of them on here for you. But check this out this week from Tag Team Recoveries. Watch this. Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Tag Team Recoveries. Uh, one of our first hunts for the fall here. At my first hole here, and first good signal today is part of a harmonica reed. And this is real cool, it was hitting real high, man, it was up in the 80s. But check this out, this looks like a colonial bell. Check that thing out. That is real cool. What you got, buddy? A Skelta key. Oh, cool deal, man. Look at that complete, man. It's nice to find those things complete like that, bud. Down probably about eight inches or so, but it is a cool brass padlock, man. Still got the door on top of it, but that is pretty cool. I like that piece. Well, to add to our lock collection, Jeff ended up just getting himself one there. Another lock for the day. Yeah. Pretty cool. That's brass, too, and Yep. Awesome. Cool. A lot of big targets in here. Yeah. Alright, dude. What are we looking at here, man? The big pan to a shoulder epaulet. Look at that, man. It's the top piece of the pan. Awesome, awesome. Check that out, guys. Heck yeah. But th this is part of the pan, guys. That was part of the shoulder applet. There'd be a set of scales that would come down through here. It's like six of them. It would come through here, and that would actually sit on the shoulder of the uh, soldiers during the Civil War. But that is so cool. Unfortunately, it was folded over, but Jeff got it straightened out, man. But that is cool, buddy. Guys, boom. I am so stoked right here. My next target I just dug, just totally incredible. And I just called the fellas over. Got Jeff over here. <laughs> got Daniel over here. And I want you guys to take a peek of what I just popped up out of this hole. If you can see it sitting down there. But look at that. That is a spur from a Civil War. That's pretty. Look at that, guys. And it is complete, it's man. Perfect. 
perfect. Absolutely perfect. Oh my goodness, what a find. What a find. Whew, that has just made, made it right there. Awesome, awesome, awesome. You guys are just doing a great job over there at Tag Team Recoveries. Boy, relic after relic after relic. Head on over there, check out this entire video. I couldn't fit it all on here, but head on over there. Tell them you saw them here on the Weekly Dirt and say, look guys, love the relics you're finding. Keep up the great work. Give them some support. I'm sure they'd appreciate it. You guys are doing a great job. Tag Team Recoveries, go check it out. So I love it when I'm watching these videos and the people find something they don't really know what they have and at the very last second, they finally discover what they have in their hands and it blows their minds. I love it. This is exactly what happened this week. To High Lux Yoda and his digging partner. Let's go check out what these boys were digging out of these old swimming holes. Check it out this week. High Lux Yoda. Watch this. But I just found this. It's a looks like an old money clip on the back of the clip there it says in appreciation Milton S lawn company Sometimes I see a huge gold ring in there it looks like white gold I haven't touched it let me look let me look ready yeah shoot no that ain't white gold that's yellow gold Is it? yeah that's high key. oh that's man. huge man look at the size of whoa it. whoa <laughs> wow was it saying or anything? Wow. Any writing or dates? Wow, it's a big one, dude. Well, it's got the signature on it, but. Yeah, it's definitely yellow gold. Wow. Wow, way to go, man. Way to go. Um, It's one of those OB with the 10K in between the OB. Nice. 1905. So that's oldie. Yeah. Oldie but goodie. That's a good city edge right there. Whew. Oh yeah, that's a huge gold that's band That's big, there. dude. That's a big ring, man. That's a big ring. Hold on, look at it there. If you guys can see that, he's got, wait, there's, dude, there's ridges on it. Oh, it's a, oh, it's a token, dude. It's a token. Yeah, well, I saw the reader. That was a it's a token. Holy That's a gold coin! Dude. There's a, dude, there's a fisherman over there. No way. It's a gold coin, dude. No way. It's a gold, it's a gold coin. It's a gold coin. Oh, that's a token. Wait. That's a large scent, dude. No, dude, it's it's gold. It's gotta be. It's gotta be. Oh. Oh. Oh, dude, yeah. Oh. Oh, crap. What is it, 20? Uh, to ten dollars. <laughs> oh crap! Oh crap! Oh, it almost looks brass, man. Oh crap! Look at uh, that ten dollar gold piece. Oh, oh my god! Oh my god! Dude. Ever since I started watching videos from High Lux Yoda, boy, I've been searching for swimming holes around here in Colorado because over the years, you got to go check out all his videos on his channel. He has found the goods, man. He has found some incredible rings over the years, some incredible jewelry in those old swimming holes, and he just tears it up. He does a great job. This week was no exception. Excellent rings pulled out of the thing. I couldn't, you got to go back and check out the whole video. And then his buddy pulls the top of the bucket lister, $10 gold coin. What an amazing find, buddy. Great job this week from High Lux Yoda. Go check out that video. Become a fan. Subscribe to his channel. Tell him you saw him here on the Weekly Dirt. Awesome. Hey, I got a few announcements for you. Hey, for those of us in the metal technical community, you know there's a lot of live streaming going on these days. And I'm telling you, no one does it better than Riser's Treasure Hunting Emporium. You gotta go over and catch some of his live streams. Just an awesome job. Some of his some of his digs, some of his hunts are just amazing. But I'll tell you what, he's having a giveaway. He's doing a giveaway involving a Garrett Carrot. So I'm gonna put a link down below. You gotta go over there and check it all out, see what it's all about, and get involved. Riser's Treasure Hunting Emporium. Go check it out. 
hey who's having a 200 sub giveaway hot dog 70 is having a 200 sub giveaway the giveaway ends monday so you got to get in on it right away congratulations to you there hot dog 70 everyone go give them some support tell them you saw them here on the weekly dirt and get involved in that giveaway great job hey the silver slingers the silver slingers are doing a giveaway i'm going to put a link down below they always do a great job with their giveaways this one is no exception you got to go get involved in it go check it out the silver slingers links down below go get on it tell them you saw them here on the weekly dirt that'd be great stay tuned keep your eyes open for some announcements about my next digger spotlight coming up with plug master ford that's right i'll be putting out some information about that soon but that's what i have for you this week here on the weekly dirt i'm dk with adventures in dirt have yourself a great week i'll see you next sunday